Hello, I've made this short video as I know some of you are a little bit worried about returning to school after such a long period of time off. Firstly, it's absolutely normal to feel a mix of excitement, anxiety, happiness, anticipation. Lots of young people were really stressed when the schools closed and many of you lost your sense of structure of the daily routine. So this new period of transition transitioning back into school and settling back in might cause some stress or anxiety. Not just in young people, but the teachers too, me included. The school is going to look quite different for a while. So the school environment has changed and our routines have changed. So it's a little scary not knowing what to expect. One thing that has definitely not changed though is our commitment to you. The staff will be in, they'll be pleased to see you and they will want to hear all about your experiences as well as telling them, telling you about theirs and they will be there to help you to catch up with any gaps in your knowledge, any struggles you've had with the homeworking. That's our job. Every member of staff at HRC is absolutely brilliant at what they do so we will get you where you need to be. We will help you adapt more quickly. SLT have put lots of things in place to keep you more safe and to make the school feel more predictable and consistent. We're going to have a much larger focus on mental health and well-being to help you process your experiences and ultimately help you to be ready to learn and re-engage with education. My experience of lockdown has been varied. Something I've really enjoyed has been doing exercise in my living room every day. I've also enjoyed dusting off my old bike, getting onto my old bike and going for bike rides, even though I've not been for a bike ride in years. I feel fitter and stronger than I have done in a very long time. Some of the low points in lockdown have been around missing my family. My parents live two hours away and it's been really tough not to have seen them. I found home working really hard and difficult as well. And there's been times when I could have easily thrown my laptop out of the window with frustration because it just wasn't working again. While I'm really excited about coming back to work and seeing you and seeing the staff, I'm also apprehensive too. I haven't really been around lots of people over the last few months, so I'm feeling a bit self-conscious. I'm nervous about teaching again and I feel like a new and inexperienced teacher and I'm worried in case I've actually forgotten how to teach because it's been so long. But I think, just like riding a bike, you never forget. And once I'm there in front of you, it will feel like nothing's changed at all. You might feel the same. You might feel like you did when you came into year seven all over again. So coming back into school might feel a little bit uncomfortable at first. Being uncertain about something mixed with the changed environment can make us feel anxious and it can knock our self-confidence. But once you're there, you'll realise that your fears were just exaggerated in your mind and you should have a positive, or at the very least, a neutral experience. We will check in on you. We will listen to what's changed, to what's, what's changed in your lives and what's been lost. You can talk about your lives and how you feel about the situation or the schoolwork or anything else at all. In the meantime, there are some things that you can do to help yourselves. Remember that a little bit of anxiety and stress is actually really good for you. It makes you more alert, more focused, and you can prepare, prepare for things better. I've added a couple of worksheets with some top tips on how to cope and some links to video uh, that show breathing techniques, relaxation ex exercises, and how to challenge unhelpful thoughts. Finally, make sure you get enough sleep. We can't tackle anything at all if you're sleep deprived. Good luck and we'll see you next week.